All right, hey everyone, this is the uh, Puff Drink Talk podcast. This is the cigar, cigar review, and today I'm going to be smoking the La Aroma de Cuba Mi, Mi Amor. And this is a Nicaraguan origin with a San Andreas Mexico wrapper, and the filler is Nicaraguan. The taste notes profiles are earth. Coca leaves, espresso, spices, with a hint of a little bit of licorice at the end is what it says. So I'm excited to try this. Um, so let's dive right into it. I Today I'm going to be doing a V-cut. <clears throat> uh, where is the camera? There we go. So this is the front of it. It is a box press Robusto that I'm going to be smoking today. That's Very hot. beautiful. Very beautiful. Let me get into I love that V cut. V cuts are my favorite. The sound is great. Yeah. A little off center, but you know what? It's alright. Smells earthy, smells leathery. Smells sweet. Cold draw is very earthy. Earth, dirt. A little sweet finish at the end. Very interesting. But overall, very good. Excited to try this. All right. Welcome back, everyone, for the first draw. Just lit this bad boy up, and it is a spectacular smoky smell to it. A little bit of a firecracker smell, but a little sweetness to it also, a little interesting mix. All right, here's the first puff. Creamy, coffee, nut, it's very smooth, very smooth draw. Ooh, this is this is good. This is gonna be fantastic. This is a Christmas holiday time type of cigar. You get a lot of that holiday festive. Um, I don't know how to describe it other than it reminds you of like Christmas. It reminds me reminds you of like Thanksgiving time. Uh, everyone around the the you know having like a like a pie and a coffee yeah. and sitting together and kind of enjoying eggnog and whatnot. Um, the aroma, just the, the 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 flavor, the smell. Very easy. Mm. Ah, beautiful, beautiful. Love this first puff. Love this cigar so far. See you for the first third. Oh. Welcome back for the uh, first third of the La Aroma de Cuba, Meu Amor. Um, he put in a, a Portuguese Meu Amor. Meu <laughs> yeah. Amor. Sorry, my Spanish is not good. My <laughs> Portuguese is on point. Uh, but I think I'm on to my second third with this one. I've just been smoking this. You're down. You are very down. Yeah, really that. I, I like this cigar. It is a very easy, just fun cigar to smoke. So uh, here's the first third, second third. Puff of this, no change at all of the flavor other than uh, creamy, nutty, uh, cocoa leaf, or like a cocoa flavor, coffee flavor, creamy, chocolatey, just very easy to smoke. Nice drop, burns easily. Uh, nothing negative about this cigar at all. It's just a great, great, easy, fun cigar to smoke. So I guess I'll probably see you at the final, final third. Final third. <laughs> Almost, I've yeah. just been smoking on this thing, talking and, and, and smoking. This is this is fun. This is a good one. So cheers. This is the final third of my cigar. I took the band off and just look at that burn. Nice, even burn, smooth draw.
starting to get a little bit bitter at towards the end, but still nothing, nothing too bad that I can't. Uh, uh, there's some type of cigars when you get towards the end and it starts getting bitter that you're like, Jesus, it tastes like a rotten egg or you just don't want to, you don't want to smoke it anymore. It's just, it's not, uh, does that ever happen to any, does that happen to you? Only if I smoke it backwards. Get the hell out of here. Come it's on. a it's a common thing on cigars because when it gets towards the end, uh, it gets too hot. So you gotta you slow Purge down it. the draw. Yeah. So yeah. instead of pulling the draw the same way you're pulling in the beginning, you just slow down the draw a little bit, and then yeah. you got a better experience. Well, and that's what I'm saying is I'm still able to pull in the same draw that I had from the beginning towards the end, mm-hmm. with very minimal uh, bitterness or or really changing the flavor profile of this again i'm still tasting creamy i'm still tasting coffee i'm still tasting nutty co you know chocolate coca leaves it's just um it's a really good cigar and uh, i'm ready to give my uh my final score on it. i'm gonna give this a uh 94 i'm gonna go with the 94 wow. it is a Good high scoring cigar, and uh, I've thoroughly enjoyed this cigar. It's uh, it it's up wow. there. It's an up there. It's a wow. It's a wow cigar, but it's fun. It's just a fun cigar to smoke. Perfect size just to converse, talk, drink, have a little fun with this. So, um, thank you very much for sticking through this cigar review. If you've enjoyed it, give it, uh, give this review a thumbs up, comment like again this is also extracted from the puff drink talk podcast today we were talking about the history uh, of thanksgiving and some of our personal traditions and other things that we go into the melting pot that is the united states as well as the tradition the traditions of thanksgiving that we hold on to but we're willing to give up and change for other things Uh, So thank you very much for sticking around, and I hope you have a blessed night. Cheers.